Tonight, a look into the making of our fireworks at the Fountain event. The Central Florida family is helping us bring you some amazing sights at Lake Eola this Independence Day, and they have been doing it for decades, like half a century. News 6's Jerry Askin has more on how they're getting results and making sure everybody can enjoy the holiday without putting themselves at risk. It's a view that Bill Cook and his family can't get enough of, all while celebrating a major holiday. Is the 4th of July your favorite holiday? Absolutely, 100%. I mean, look what I get to do. I, mean, I, get to, I get to light it up for everybody. And he loves it. Bill Cook gave me a behind-the-scenes look at his fireworks setup as he's safely prepping to light up the skies in Brevard County for the 4th of July. Of course, I, I have no explosives with me right now. I'm... I'm Doing this safely, this is nothing but plastic and wood. This is an igniter. It will ignite the shell and then it'll launch it into the air. He works for Zambelli Fireworks, who provides the annual 4th of July fireworks in parts of Brevard County and beyond, including at Front Street Park on the Melbourne Causeway. And for the Cook family, doing fireworks shows in Brevard dates back to more than half a century. For Melbourne, Florida... My, my grandfather, Calvin Cook, started in 1968. He told me his late grandfather, Calvin Cook, loved fireworks so much that he volunteered with a fireworks crew before he was offered to shoot a fireworks show himself. Since then, for Melbourne, it has been Calvin Cook, Steve Cook, Tim Cook, or Bill Cook. That's myself. For 55 years, we have shot the Melbourne show. The current patriarch, Steve Cook, my father, he's retiring this year. He's shooting Palm Bay currently. The city of Melbourne releasing a statement to News 6, saying in part, the city of Melbourne is thrilled to work with the Cook family and are always confident that they will provide a jaw-dropping fireworks show. We are proud to celebrate their history and enthusiasm for what they do for the Zambelli company and everyone who enjoys their work. Cook told me he and the Zambelli fireworks team pray before each show to make sure everyone is safe. And speaking of safety. The best thing to do is leave it to the professionals. Be safe. Everybody out there, be safe. I'm Jerry Askin, getting results, News 6.